Okay, next thing I had to do was this middle piece where the hood latch, the head latch goes on. This used to go and then screw into that piece. Now the issue is this stuff was in the way for the intercooler. So I cut the metal out, welded it. So now, you know, it doesn't want to move. So I got an extra two inches, inch and a half of space for the intercooler. All right. This is going to be the template or the holder for the intercooler. Uh, I still have to cut the hole out for the air to flow through. There's going to be about a three quarters of an inch of weather stripping between this plate and the intercooler. And I have to cut the other half of the square out for the wire. I mean, not the wire, the hose to go through. So. It's moving along. I'm out of daylight. We'll continue this tomorrow. Alright, now I have these done. These are going to be the anchoring brackets. I go like this. And they attach to the metal. And then I just got to drill a hole right in here. Check this out. Okay. Yeah. 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 <laughs> this is in that front section of the Monte Carlo. All painted. Silicone the edges. I left a little gap at the top. And then I use weather stripping all the way around. And I don't know if you can see. There you go. So I think it turned out pretty good. <sighs> Alright, so this is what it looks like all bolted together. It's gonna come out the sides. All right, next step mounting this on the front of that. So I'm gonna use the factory rubber rubber mounts. You know. These slide on the bottom, but and it takes a um, 29 30 seconds hole to get this rubber mounted incorrectly to where it doesn't pop out. So, yay, let's try this. All right, I just finished the bottom. There's where the drain plug comes. And there's two studs. That's the bottom. So let me flip it over, get the top done, and uh, see what it looks like all put together. All right, let's see. I still have to do the top brackets, but I think it looks all right. I think it turned out good. That's where the hoses are going to come out. They're going to come underneath this. 
and up towards the front. All right, these are the factory top <clears throat> top brackets from the Eclipse. They used to have these rubber mounts in it. So now I'm, I built these tabs, so it'll be removable. I can pull the radiator out, and uh, all I have left to do now: box in the sides, trim this front a little more because I don't need it sticking out that far. Um, and then paint them. And then there is already a couple. I don't know if you could, you can't see it. There's a tap. There's a tapped hole right back here. And let's see if there's one on this side. <clears throat> And there's one on this side so I should be able to use those stock the stock tab uh, mounting holes and then this will be done all right I just got to finish welding the box ends inside of this so uh, now I gotta grind it up make it look pretty I think I'm going to take this edge and go on an angle because I don't need all of that. So, uh, yep, get back to work. Alright, that's the finished product for the top mount. Uses a factory bolt hole with the factory rubber from the Mitsubishi inside my bracket. So, nice and snug.